What is going on YouTube? It's your boy here, Kieran the Barber. Today I've come here with a question for you all. I've got three questions I want to ask you and I want you to answer in the comments below. That's all I want you to do. So I have a big question for you all. The three big questions. Um, it's been an argument what's been going on for a long time now on social media groups and, and stuff like that between more maybe say traditional barbers and more modern barbers like myself. Um, now I own a barbershop, I've owned a barbershop for the last six to eight months. It's doing really well. Um, the question is, in your barbershop, where you either where you work or your own, do you cut women's hair in your barbershop? I'm not saying full long length, take it up, highlights, bloody tints, condition treatments, bobs. I'm saying if a woman comes in and she asks for a flat top, which no one else around can do, hairdressers can't do it, there's few and far from, she comes to you because she knows that you can do a flat top yourself. Would you then go, that's fine, take a seat in my seat, a flat top's a flat top, right? Regardless of what sex or gender it's on. Or would you go, sorry, you're a female, um, I run a barbershop where I don't actually allow females in my shop. Um, I, want you, I want you to comment and tell me what your opinion is and what your view is and what you deal with in your shop. That's what I really, really want to know. So now, for real guys, I'm for this argument. Um, and it, there's many reasons. I, I actually cut women's hair in my shop. It's an appointment based shop. So one, it deters people if they're willing to be upset from a woman being in a barbershop then because it's on an appointment system by the time the appointment's over and the female has left the shop the other male will enter it's, n it's no big issue and to be honest i think if you have a problem with a female being in a barbershop i probably wouldn't want you in my shop anyway it, my shop is very multicultural i do a lot of asians a lot of afro hair a lot of of all different kinds of hair and in and i think if you're restricted to one then that's, that's your problem, it's, it's, I'm just very for it in, my, in the sense of if a woman comes into my shop and she asks for say a pompadour um, I can carry out the service, I can do the haircut um, I can style it to the way she wants to be styled it and she walks out happy and she's a paying customer what's, what's the deal, What does it matter what genitals she has it, it really doesn't, it doesn't matter what she's got down below it's her hair on top so guys, my question number two is, if you are a male or a female going into a barber shop or a hairdresser's, this is for more the clients than the barber themselves, do you have a preference in who cuts you? Do you prefer a male? Do you prefer a female? Do you prefer, any, like, do you prefer just anyone? You don't care. My argument for this and my opinion for this is, I don't care who can cut my hair. Um, and this is probably going to offend some people, I'm, I'm sorry if it does, but I cut hair with my hands. My hands, my head, my heart. In a sense of, if my head knows what to do and my heart is telling me to do it, then my hands will do it. I have never ever once cut hair with my genitals. I once see some guy cut hair with their feet, which was pretty cool, but never with their genitals. Whether you are male or female, transgender or whatever you are, straight, gay, lesbian, black, white, Asian, the hands, Ev everyone has a pair, pretty much. Um, so what the point, the point is, it shouldn't matter as long as you can cut hair good. Um, now I know a lot of people are very different and that's why I want to hear everyone's opinions down below. So I want everyone to go and comment and give me their opinion, especially if you're a client. Um, tell me who cuts your hair, tell me if it's a male or a female or it doesn't bother you. Tell me why you would prefer a male to cut your hair, tell me why you would prefer a female to cut your hair. Um, I, I want to know everyone's answers in the comments below. So now on to question number three. Question number three is um, a bit of a weird one because I want to know if you restrict yourself to one hair type. I know um, there is a Afro Barbers down the road and they strictly only cut Afro hair um, and they cut seldomly Asian hair but they will not cut white hair. Um, and I know there's a few shops which they have not been taught in Afro hair so therefore they will not cut Afro hair, they will refuse to do it. I've worked in shops where they refuse to do Afro hair. Um, 
Me personally, I am taught in all of them. I'm a bit of an all-rounder. I can cut in. I can cut white. I can cut Asian. I can cut Afro. I can I can cut women's to a certain extent as long as they have a more of a shorter hairstyle. I choose that to my apprentices. Whenever I get an apprentice in, I always say, do not restrict yourself because fashion is always changing. I, yeah, you've got a pompadour in now and the pompadour, I mean, I have one, I have a side part. Um, um, my apprentice right now cuts it amazing. But six, seven years ago, it was a V cut and everyone had a V cut and a mullet, you know, and who has them anymore? Very few and far from people have them now. So styles and fashion changes, and that's the same for Caucasian hair, Afro hair, Asian hair. All styles change all the time. That's why I tell them to keep up to date and learn everything. Everything, because then it's a widespread, and you don't feel awkward when a client walks into your shop and you go, ah, oh, oh, I can't do that, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to turn you away. That you're not only turning away a customer, you're turning away all of his friends when he goes to his friends and he goes, nah, they can cut me, so there's no point going there and you're turning away money, and no one ever wants to turn away money, right? So I wanna know your opinion on it. If you restrict yourself to one um, or two types of hair, and why, um, and that is, that is all I've really got to say. Please leave a comment below. I wanna hear everyone's comments. I really, really do. I really wanna hear everyone and what they've got to say on it. And I wanna hear um, that like button be impressed. I really wanna hear that like button be impressed. And I want to hear the subscribe button be impressed. I really hope you have a good weekend, good day, good start to your week. What day are we on? We're on Wednesday now, I think. So I hope you have a good start to your week. I hope you enjoy your weekend. Um, it's Christmas next week. Woo hey! Um, I'm going to be doing a Christmas giveaway. So keep up to date with that. No, my yeah, my next. Ah. Oh. So Sunday, I'm going to be filming. Um, a celebrity haircut. Now, this kid is on the Disney Channel in a minute, and if you want to get his look, stay tuned in because I should have the video edited and aired by Monday evening of next week. Guys, enjoy your weekend. Thank you for watching.